Right. You've got five minutes this time, so yeah, enjoy. Okay. Fill your boots. Right. Five minutes. I've been here a couple of minutes, probably. Um, firstly, I, I'm the warm-up warm -up act uh, for, for Shirley, who, who follows me. Um, but um, I would like uh, to thank both um, RAF Cosford and the YES, the Youth Education Support uh, Body, for their kind invite to this Aviation Education Conference. It's wonderful to see here today a room of educational professionals and aviation enthusiasts giving their valued time, knowledge, learning and inspiration, focusing on careers and the importance of STEM, science, technology, engineering and mathematics to our up and coming youngsters. This gives you all the excellent opportunity to become ambassadors working together to inspire the next generation in, in STEM, ensuring that the UK is at the forefront in this important area of development. The day's programme has been put together to ensure that you all hopefully learn something new, forge links and networks with other like-minded professionals, and more importantly, ensuring that our next generation are equipped for the future and our country. And with that, uh, that ends my little uh, two minutes. Uh, so thank you again for the invite, and thank you. All right. I heard you were listening last year. That was good. Yeah. <laughs> thank you very much for coming. Shirley. You've got 12 minutes of power. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I was assuming Steve would overrun, so I didn't like that one. <laughs> okay. Right, well, thank you for inviting me here today. Um, as the lead member for education, employment, and lifelong learning for Telford and Meeting Borough Council, I'm really passionate about inspiring our youngsters to be the best they can be and to realise there are many, many avenues open to them. As fellow educators, we've got a duty to ensure that they have access to these opportunities and to engage them through the experiences within the STEM curriculum, to open their eyes to various career paths. We are very privileged to have RAF Cosford in our area. They support our schools and colleges, not only with many different activities, but also explaining to them that there are different career paths open to them, and surprisingly, the RAF is not just about pilots. Cosford is uh, well placed in Shropshire, it nestles alongside Telford and Reekin, which is the fastest growing town in the West Midlands. We are ranked number two for housing delivery nationally, and we build at least 1,200 homes, uh, new homes a year. We've got the highest concentration of technical workers outside of the South East, that is a little known fact. And we are um, home to some of the most um, famous household names, including Muller, Hines, BAE Systems, we built Challenger Tanks, Pap Gemini, HMRC, Rico, and of course Harriet Cosford, to name but a few. We've attracted much overseas investment in the UK, the largest for the last 10 years. STEM is being used in many creative ways in our schools, even the local primary schools, and it is vital this work starts early on. So the use of the STEM within the curriculum, it's